Welcome to BCH Technologies. In this video, we will see how many pages a refillable Canon cartridge can print. Just a quick review, ink is stored in a sponge inside the cartridge. Canon made the sponge very tiny so you have to buy cartridges more often. In the last video, we replaced the original sponge with a large BCH sponge and filled it up. We use the cartridge made in that video and see how many pages we can print. If you find the cartridge's LED light is steady yellow, don't worry. The printer's ink gauge is not accurate for refilled cartridges. A steady yellow light only means the printer thinks the ink is low. We will show you how to turn off the ink gauge. You may find the printer prints partial pages and then restart. This is because you put the paper guide too wide. Make it narrower and make sure the paper is fed straight down. Okay, we are ready to feed this pack of Boise papers through the printer. Remember we have 10 milliliters black ink and 5 milliliters each in color cartridge. We will give away these two cartridges, with free shipping within the US, in our lab demo group. We announce free equipment giveaway here. You can see both cartridges show low ink warning now. We have plenty of ink but the printer doesn't know. Nothing to worry about. A lot more pages printed. Notice the lead light is still steady yellow. Now lead lights are flashing and a window pops up. It is time to disable the ink gauge. Canon tells you what to do. It says holding down the stop button for 5 seconds to continue printing. We will do just that. You need to do this for the color cartridge later. Once it is done, the printer will print forever. The LED light will be flashing yellow from now on. If you don't like to see it, put a duct tape over it. In the next episode, we will make a spongeless refillable cartridge and compare the pages printed per refill. Also, we are interested in how many refills a cartridge can last. If you print over 5000 pages a month, please contact us. Now you can see the black faded, but the color is still okay. We stop the printing and see where the black started fading. Now we are going to add 10 milliliters ink into the black cartridge and make it print the same quality as the last good copy. Five milliliters each time. We used a priming syringe puffing one milliliter of air to help ink going to the bottom. As good as new. By the way, we could add 2 to 5 milliliters more ink, but we want to keep the top of the sponge dry. Here are Canon's specifications for the ink volume in each model. I hope you enjoy this video. Visiting us at www.bchtechnologies.com. Happy printing! Cheers!